directly come dancing star and Arsenal footballing legend Tony Adams and partner Katya Jones performed the Cha Cha to the Grandstand theme tune on Saturday evening. Despite all odds and viewers' verdicts, Tony made it through to yet another week in the competition and seems to be getting entertainment votes from the public. However, it has been reported that Tony has allegedly broken BBC advertising rules by wearing his own clothing brand to rehearsals whilst being filmed. After their entertaining the judges with his performance, Tony and Katya received a score of 19 out of a possible 40 and managed to swerve the dreaded dance off. However, during the VT that showed the dancing duo's grueling rehearsals, Tony was seen wearing a blue collared shirt and a white round neck t-shirt from his clothing brand, which he launched in 2019. A show insider has claimed to The Sun that he was unclear on the rules and didn't think he was doing any harm despite the BBC's strict advertising rules. He was just dancing in clothes he feels comfortable in, which just happened to be part of his collection. Strictly bosses are going to have a word with him and ensure he's in line with their rules for this weekend's show, they expressed. For years the BBC's website has stated that all advertising must be clearly presented as commercial content, distinct from editorial content. The nature of an advertising relationship must be transparent so that it is clear to the audience that they are seeing a commercial message. Surreptitious or subliminal advertising is prohibited, it outlines. The logo which was picked up is a silhouette of himself celebrating during Arsenal's victory over Everton in 1998. Express.co.uk contacted the BBC which declined to provide an official comment. Receiving his comments from the judges on Saturday night, Craig Revel Horwood expressed, Well, that reminded me of a scene from Death Becomes Me. I don't know how to describe what I have just seen apart from you putting everything into it. Moxie Mobuse was crying with laughter before she said, Tony. Honestly, every year I say, I've never seen anything like this and then another year comes and I see a cha-cha like that. Shirley Ballas commented, I am speechless. You are an absolute ray of sunshine, the upper half of your body you are just fantastic. When we get below the knees it is absolutely raining. You just misstepped everywhere. It has to be on some sort of timing and it has got to be on some sort of action. Keep going but today. There were missteps. Anton Dubeka exclaimed, Wow! You did a great Cuban break. I don't know what the rest of it was but. Comedian and singer Jade Adams was eliminated from the show on Saturday night after ending up in the bottom two with Molly Rainford and Carlos Gu. Following Jade's exit, Tony paid homage to her on his Instagram story, writing, God I'm going to miss my co-Adams. It's been a long time since I've got into trouble for laughing too much. I cannot wait to laugh with you again, we'll miss your enthusiasm, love, honesty and sheer joy at Miss J. Adams. According to bookmakers William Hill, Tony's odds of being eliminated from the show on Sunday night stand at 6-1. Strictly Come Dancing airs Saturday from 6.30pm on BBC One, followed by the results on Sunday.